Alright guys, what's up? It's Icy Crab here, and today we are going to go to the Aether, because it's fun and stuff. Anyway, to build an Aether portal, you do one block, two block, three block, four, and then one, two, three, four, that high. Make sure it's this high, because if it isn't, you're going to fail. I'm going to teach you little kids how to build an Aether portal. Look at this thing. Look, I think I did it wrong. Did I do it wrong? No, this is it. Alright, so you have to make it out of glowstone in a formation like an obsidian portal that you would go to the nether with. So it has to be like this. And then, you take a water bucket. You know, like this thing right here that I'm holding in my hand, a water bucket. You dump it. No, you don't have to do that. You just have to make three iron bars. Pick it up in water. And then, you put it anywhere in within the glowstone formidity of the portal. Like here. Never f oh, it worked. Yay! Alright. Now, it's blue and pretty and stuff. And you'll probably hear a creepy noise. But don't get worried. Just go! Go! And then we'll go to the Aether. Pro tip, Ambrosium Shards are great for fueling enhancers and food. Oh, really now? Anyway, when you first enter the Aether, it's gonna have to build the terrain, if you didn't know. Which is gonna take a very long time, because the Aether is a completely new world that has nothing to do with the original Minecraft whatsoever. And by that I mean there's no original blocks in it. These are all new blocks. And then here we are. We are in the Aether. Now I'm just going to let the world spawn for a little bit because it's going to lag my game out terribly. And look at this. Look at this. This isn't regular dirt. What is this world? This is like heaven on Minecraft. If you don't know, they actually have new achievements. So if we scroll down here, what the hell is wrong with my mouse? See? There's Aether achievements. Yeah, look at these Aether achievements. See? And then you get to ascend to the Aether, which is pretty cool, because you go up. And then you have to bounce on a blue cloud, craft a graphite tool, read a book of lore. Don't know what a book of lore is, it's these little things right here. If you open it, you can put something in it, and then it'll tell you about it. But it can only be Aether items. I'm explaining this thing to you. And also, there's other things, like these guys. They blow snowballs at you, and those snowballs, if you get hit by them, here, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me, you fucking retards, hit me. Hit me, give me this one. I'll come. I don't know how they do it. But they go over your head, apparently. But if you do get hit by them, they, like, bounce you back, and you'll be like, Whoa! And then you might fall off, which kind of sucks. But don't worry. If you fall off, you'll just fall back to the regular world. Or you'll spawn on top of your portal. And if you do that, you're probably going to die, because it's going to hurt and stuff. Anyway, you can break dirt a lot faster in the Aether. Because, you know, it's Aether, and everything breaks a lot faster. I don't know why. Don't explain to me. There's also Aether trees. I don't know what they're called. They're just trees. And there's also these silly little motherfuckers. Whatever they are. They're whales, apparently. And you can make them fly. Look at that thing. It's flying. Up to that thing. Whatever it is. Hit me. Damn it. He missed. And there's another Aether whale. Here. Get out of the fucking way. I don't know if this is a glitch or if they're supposed to do this, but yeah, they just kind of derp around in the world. They don't do anything. I don't think you can hurt them. And there it goes. Goodbye, Aether whale. And these are the Aether trees. I think it's called, like, Skyroot or something. But they break a little bit faster than normal trees on Minecraft because it's the Aether. And as I told you before, stuff in Aether breaks a lot faster. So we're just going to cut down one of these trees. Oh, whoa. There is a perfect example of how those little gay-ass little motherfuckers that blow snowballs at you, they can blow you really hard and then you'll get blown far away. I don't know what those things are, but apparently they're mobs. And if you have a saddle, you can ride on them. And if you ride on them, you can fly. I think. I'm not sure how that works. Get the fuck off my grill, you bitch. That thing really wants to annoy me. Hey, hey, no, no, get away from me. Maybe crouching will help. I'm just trying to cut down a tree. Get away from me. Alright, let's get some aether wood. Some skyroot. And they can also drop skyroot, uh, what are they called? Get the fuck away from me. They can drop skyroot, whatever they're called. Saplings. Yeah, saplings. Right, can I cut down one tree in peace, please? I've already explained enough to you guys about what the Aether is and how it works. These guys suck with accuracy. They're like the little seven-year-olds that play World at War. Alright, Skyroot Log. And another thing you can do is you can open up the Aether book, and you can put the Skyroot Log in it, and it tells you stuff about it. It says Skyroot Wood. Wood from Skyroot Trees makes Skyroot Planks. That's cool. I have to hurry up because I'm almost dead. I don't want to die. Actually, I'm going to go to Peaceful. Yeah, I'm a little wuss. I don't care, though. Alright, Skyroot Log, go up there and give me some Skyroot, whatever they're called. Why is it lagging so hard? Whoa, lag. This is terrible. Hey, get out of here. Alright, I'm just gonna let my HP heal up. There we go. Now we'll go back to normal. And I'm gonna take a water drink. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that water is so good. Okay, stop with my... Holy shit, these guys are annoying. Seriously. Screw off, kid. 
And then we're going to make some Skyroot planks. These is just like the wood in regular Minecraft, so you can make Skyroot sticks, I guess. And there's a little tower over there, or a pillar, or a... I don't know what the hell to call it. It looks like a fucking museum. Is that good enough for you? Anyway, you can make a normal crafting table, and if you didn't know, you can't combine stuff. Like, you can't have normal wood here, and then have Skyroot sticks. It wouldn't work. So it has to be completely Skyroot, or complete, or it has to be completely Aether, or completely Minecraft Earthworld. If you know what I mean. Anyway, I saw, I saw some ores around here somewhere. Yeah, over there. As you can see, this world is pretty complex. It kind of does look like the nether, just without the lava floor. And it looks prettier and not as red and de devilish. But yeah, this is our first ore we're gonna get. Yeah, let's get this ore, Jimmy! Oh, yeah! Give me this ore, son. And for some reason, I don't know if it's just my game, but every time I hit with the pick, it double drops. And if you actually read the little book and put your Skyrim thing in here, Diggs, Holy Stone, and Aether Ores randomly gives double drops, but I always get double drops. So I don't know if that's a glitch, and if they just haven't fixed it, or it's just my game conflicting with other mods, which there's only one other mod, which is too many items. And I used that so I could get the glowstone and all that, because when I tried to use the inventory edit, whenever I opened the world, it just deleted the items as if they weren't in my inventory in the first place, which they were. So I don't know if they just need to fix that. They're probably going to have a big fix update, which will be 1.2, because they already did have one bug fix update, which was 1.1. So I guess while we're here, we just get double drops. And another thing with the pickaxe is, it, it, it's like a super tool. It breaks everything really fast. Like, usually, you would need a shovel or something to break it this fast, but it still breaks really fast. And like dirt, it doesn't double drop. It just gives you one. But everything else, like ores and stone, I'm guessing, it double drops. So don't ask me on that one how that works. You're going to have to ask the creators, whoever they are. Anyway, with this, let's open the lore book. Let's put the Ambrosium Shard. Found in Holy Stone, makes Ambrosium torches and is the fuel of the Enhancer. Alright, so this pretty much makes torches, except it only gives you two. And they're different torches. I'm not sure if they light up more than, like, other, or than, like, the regular torches. I'm just gonna get rid of all that. Because I wouldn't know. I'm a pro. Okay, stop taking fall damage. I mean, if I fell from the side, I don't think I would die. Or I don't think I would get damaged. Like, look, even the trees. Even the trees, the pick breaks a little bit faster. So don't ask me why that does. I really don't know. You know, bugs, that usually happens with all the new crazy mods that everyone likes. Okay, I thought it was almost dead there. You never know. What is this? What the fuck? Oh shit, what, what the hell? I have not seen this thing yet. What are you? Oh my god, he poisoned me. Oh my god, run. Whoa, I'm, I'm tripping out. I'm tripping out, yo! I can't move! No, no, don't fucking die. Oh shit, oh shit. Look, look at me, I'm not even doing the control pad and I'm moving. Oh my god, no, don't die. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Mm. Don't die. You know what? Screw this. Peaceful. Uh, recover. Mm. Recover. Keep. Hurry. Recover. What's mm. this? Oh, that's like ice root or something. That's like ice mm. stone or something. Can I trip my way to the ice stone? Okay, I'm good now. Yeah, as you can see, you really can't destroy it. That's what you need this purple stuff for. This is like xanite or something, I think. Can you even break this? You've got to be kidding me. I guess you do need a holy stone pick. Which is what this stuff is. Oh. Well, it's gone. So we'll do this. We'll go ahead and make some more sticks. And we'll make us a holy stone pick. Which is kind of like the cobblestone picks, but aether version. See, and this stuff doesn't double drop, but the ambrosium stuff and the holy stone does. I don't know how that works. I have said, I don't know how that works, like 80 million times. I don't know, it just annoys me. But now let's go ahead and make a Xanite pickaxe, which is better than that. And we'll go ahead and make a sword, too. You see, since all the things, since this pickaxe is like God, pretty much, we really don't need to make anything else. Like, we won't need to make shovels and axes and all that. Here's some more Ambrosium. We're gonna need some torches, because if you don't see... Oh... 
Well, I guess with the Xanite pickaxe, it doesn't double drop. Huh. Wow. It's kind of buggy if you ask me how the wooden one will double drop. Does it even break things faster? Yeah, it still breaks things really fast. Usually a shovel would have to break. Yeah, there's pretty much three ores I know of at the time. And we have seen two of them so far. The Ambrosium and the Xanite. Anyway, what we got here...